in this video uh, we're gonna sign up um, one of the uh, very popular uh, video conferencing app called zoom um, it's very popular uh, especially for the quality of the video so uh, if you never used this before this is great time to start so let's get started so first we're gonna go to uh, by the way uh, I'm running on Mac OS uh, Carolina so and the first we have to download um, zoom app and sign up so we open a Safari or whatever the internet browser you're gonna use and go to zoom.us so when you go there there's a website and uh, you can sign up for free there's a button here then click and enter your email address and sign up it's nothing all right so um it said we sent you the email so we're gonna check email this is the email i received and uh, activate account just click this icon i mean the the button or you can uh, copy and paste into the browser whichever you want so activate this and boom so now you enter your name and address and all that and put the password the difficult thing is this okay so the password you have to have at least eight characters at least one letters and at least one number and they use uppercase and low, lowercase characters so I need to change so it's nothing unusual here so and uh, just to click this uh, red I mean the orange uh, continue button uh, you can ask the password if you want to uh, say password you can do it you can do it and uh, you can invite uh, your colleagues or teammate if you want but you can do it later um, if you want to do it top of your head then, uh, go ahead otherwise just to click I'm not robot robot this uh, recapture button and uh, skip this process then you was you can start your test meeting now uh, this is your URL so um, if you want to uh, study a meeting uh, you can always go to this uh, address at the same time this portion these numbers will be your ID for zoom so you might want to copy this and save it somewhere it doesn't matter when but you can save somewhere safe and you can go to my account or start a meeting now Go to start meeting then you can launch then uh, it says do you want to allow this space to open zoom us then allow then now it's asking uh, to download it, it's asking a bunch of uh, permissions basically access to your video and a microphone uh, obviously you're gonna do a video conference so you need both so it's asking the permission if you don't allow this um, it's not gonna access to your camera or video so make sure you if you're gonna use this um, hit OK then uh, since um, zoom is trying to change the setting of your computer so that typically Mac asks your admin uh, approval Per se so uh, it says your username which is your computer's username so you, uh, you enter the password which you use when you log in to the computer first time I mean uh, um, when you turn on the computer and also you when you uh, log into your account uh, when you use a computer so this is a password right oops I guess I made a mistake okay now you can either join with your computer audio and when you hit that uh, it's gonna access your microphone 
and uh, when you click this automatically join audio by computer when you uh, join a meeting that means it's not gonna ask this window anymore so that's how it goes and and um, during the meeting um, if you already start the meeting um, you're gonna see uh, this portion will be whole video then uh, right now video is off so uh, you need to allow this to click this and uh, you can choose which camera you want to use uh, right now I cannot turn on because I'm recording this screen uh, to make this video so unfortunately I can't do that and uh, join the audio when you also click this it's gonna turn your audio so sometimes when you start a meeting with somebody else um, the other party says oh, I can't see you or I can't hear you you might want to check these settings so that's basically how you do it and uh, when you finish you can end meeting here meeting all then done so you just finished the meeting so you are not already uh, you are you no longer connected and uh, this zoom us app is installed on your computer under uh, application so if you're wondering where it goes next time say when you close this right uh, it's gonna stay but if you don't see in this dock what you can do is go to finder and go to applications then you're gonna find under Z here you go zoom that's where it is or if you cannot see this application folder you can go to this uh, spotlight uh, search and enter zoom and it's gonna pop up like this then you can click to launch uh, the application so um, you can technically connect uh, I mean host or join the meeting through the browser only but it's much better experience when you use app uh, downloaded on your computer so I suggest to use this zoom app instead and uh, um, everyone uh, gets uh, for free account you get the 40 minutes of free meeting each session so if you want to have longer time you have to actually pay it but uh, most of the time 40 minutes is sufficient so um, when you launch uh, the app for the second time uh, it's gonna you gonna see it something like this so um, if somebody is inviting you or if you want if you're gonna join somebody else's meeting you hit this join a meeting then enter uh, that person's ID so and uh, you enter your uh, name so whatever the name you enter here it's gonna show up the other person's screen then you can uh, choose settings say remember my names and future meetings so you don't have to type every time or um, don't connect the audio so that means you don't want to let them hear what you're saying um, so you can turn on if you want to then you if you want to turn off video if you want to participate as through the audio only you can turn this on so that's how you can join the meeting then uh, you can sign in if you uh, obviously we uh, just create account so you can sign into your account and bear with me and sign in and uh, you're gonna see like this so this is your account and uh, this join button is the same as before so you when you hit this you're gonna enter the other person's uh, ID to join their meetings instead if you want to host a meeting that means you're gonna start a meeting then somebody else is gonna join you that means start this uh, hit this button so um, you can there's two options start with new uh, or use my personal meeting ID um, when you start with this way
Okay, let me close this for now. Uh, your ID doesn't change, it never changes. So um, the other person can join all the time uh, with the same ID. That's uh, convenient, right? Then you, if you want to, you can share your screen. So um, if you have problem with your computer, then you want to other person, which is like a computer expert, to look your computer and uh, what you're doing, you can share your screen. So uh, that's pretty much it. You can schedule too, but uh, you know, we're gonna make another video for that. And uh, that's it. That's how you can start uh, your Zoom uh, using start start using uh, Zoom meeting systems. Thank you for watching.